to convey the vellum copies of the bill for Your Excellency's presidential assent. The clerk. Your Excellency, these vellum copies have the consent of the Speaker of the Houses of Parliament to present these vellum copies before you for your assent. This bill, this bill, Your Excellency, is the first bill to anchor the resolutions of the Houses of Parliament with respect to the NADCO report. You recall, Your Excellency, the NADCO report was ordered by a committee which was led by the former Vice President, Dr. Kalonzo Musioka, and the leader of the majority party in the National Assembly, the Honorable Kemani Chongwa. The Houses of Parliament adopted the report, both of them, and thereafter, the attendant bills were published, the first one being the IABC Amendment Bill, which was initially introduced and passed by the, in the National Assembly in the month of May, sent to the Senate, and the Senate also passed it on 11th of June with amendments, and the amendments passed by the Senate were approved by the National Assembly on the 20th of June. Your Excellency, this bill gives a roadmap, a roadmap to the formation of the IBC. It commences with the IBC selection panel, which will now comprise of nine persons who are to be, to be nominated in a competitive and transparent process by certain bodies, first of them being the Parliamentary Service Commission, which is required to nominate two persons. The political parties, liaison committee is required also to nominate three persons. The Law Society of Kenya, one person. is one person to be nominated by the ISIPAC, and two persons to be nominated by the Interreligious Council. The bodies which are nominating more than two persons, Your Excellency, are required to also observe the two-third gender rule so as to ensure that the completeness of the panel observes the two-third gender rule as required our, under our constitution. The bill, Your Excellency, also made certain provisions relating to the term of the, of the secretary to the commission, giving the secretary a term of four years renewable ones. Your Excellency, the bill also made certain provisions relating to facilitation of IABC with respect to its role on delimitation of boundaries, Your Excellency. Allow me to join the rest. Thank you. Thank you. So, Your Excellency, Article 135 of the Constitution requires every presidential action to be under the hand and seal of the President. Sir, permit me now to invite you to affix the public seal of the Republic or the statute. And come here, Excellency.
Your Excellency, in a symbolic display of the interdependence between the legislature and the executive in the management and public of public affairs, I kindly request that you hand over a copy of the Act to His Excellency the Deputy President, Attorney General for Publication into Law, to the Speakers of both Houses of Parliament, the former Prime Minister, to the former Vice President, as well as to the leadership of both Houses from the majority and minority parties. Your Excellency, you will open. Your Excellency, you are most graciously invited to make a few remarks. I thank you, Your Excellency. 